Deccan Chronicle is a venerable English language daily, but its publishers are in trouble. Deccan Chronicle Holdings is in debt and is facing allegations of fraud. So how did it all come to this? Over the last few years, the newspaper has opened up in several centers across the country and it's also aggressively pushing its business paper, Financial Chronicle. But analysts say the great sin was to get into unrelated businesses like buying the Deccan Chargers IPL team. While the, uh, they were uh, kind of expanding their core business, they got into unrelated diversification. That, uh, in our view, has been the main uh, reason to for them kind of overextending them uh, themselves. But while Deccan Chronicle's troubles are far worse than those of others, it may not be alone in its ambitious diversification plans. Uh, Deccan Chronicle is not unique in its uh, issues that it's facing. Uh, most newspaper industry has been very ambitious and actually have spread their wings way beyond their core business, which is of journalism, and have used uh, uh, to spread that m main core business to other businesses, whether it's aviation, whether it's uh, television. Well, if it is in the same field at least, there is uh, some convergence. However, they have moved into areas which is beyond that. For example, in the case of Deccan Chronicle, they had moved into aviation also. Besides its forays into sports, Deccan Chronicle has been buying up papers like the Asian Age. But these moves could distract newspapers from the key challenge of the future, the digital revolution. The young readers have, are staying, staying away from print. They are consuming news not newspapers, but news in a very different form. And it's not always in the form of a newspaper. Therefore, one thing that Indian newspapers will have to do is to kind of transform into news companies and start providing news across platforms which are desired by the target audience of the youth. Whatever its fate, it's clear the lessons of Deccan Chronicle will be studied for many years to come. Aditya Ramanathan, Delhi, Mint.